race has only two options when it comes to looking for advanced aliens. We can listen, or we can be more active and broadcast our willingness to talk. We'd have to think very carefully about what we might say. I think this might be just a little too risky. We only have to look at ourselves to see how intelligent life might develop into something we wouldn't want to meet. We humans are already capable of manipulating the course of our own evolution. Exactly the same, presumably, would be true of advanced extraterrestrials. Ultimately, they could halt aging and become virtually immortal. What's more, they might have reached that point millions of years ago. It might sound unlikely, but if you think about it logically, alien technology should be as extraordinary to us as a rocket ship to a caveman. I imagine they might exist in massive ships like these, having used up all the resources from the home planet below. Such advanced aliens would perhaps become nomads, looking to conquer and colonize whatever planets they can reach. If so, it makes sense for them to exploit each new planet for materials to build more spaceships so they could move on. Who knows what the limits would be? Perhaps their capabilities would only be limited by how much power they could harness and control. And that could be far more than we might first imagine. For example, it might be possible to collect the energy from an entire star. To do that, they could deploy millions of mirrors in space, encircling the whole sun and feeding the power to one single collection point. Such power might make it possible to warp the very fabric of space and create a portal called a wormhole. This portal would act like a shortcut, allowing them to travel huge distances in the blink of an eye. Like us, they would probably have evolved from a species used to exploiting whatever it can. So if aliens ever visit us, I think the outcome would be much as when Christopher Columbus first landed in America. Which didn't turn out very well for the Native Americans. So the journey that started with the search for water has led us to far off worlds 
which I think could exist. Worlds where the conditions and chemistry allow life to begin and then change into many different forms. Even so, little green men are probably pretty rare. But in such a massive place as the cosmos, we only have to look at ourselves for proof that extremely unlikely things can and do happen all the time. Let's just hope that if aliens do find us, they'll come in peace. <laughs>